Let us look at an example of ratio and proportion. Let us first start with a very basic example. Divide rupees 1024 in the ratio 9 is to 7. So what does this mean? In the ratio 9 is to 7. So basically we have to divide this into two parts. We have to divide rupees 1024 into two parts such that one part is 9x, the other part is 7x. Let's further understand this. So 9 is to 7 can be written as 9 by 7. So this is the ratio in which we want to divide rupees 1024. Now for ratios, we know that we can multiply the numerator and denominator with any number, but the number should be the same. So let's say we multiply this by x. So the denominator also needs to be multiplied by x. So this can be the same as 9x by 7x. Because basically you can then cancel x with x and it becomes 9 by 7 is the ratio. So basically what we have to do is we have to split rupees 1024 into two parts. One part is 9x, the other part is 7x. So simple equation will be 9x plus 7x is equal to 1024 or 9 plus 7 is 16 times x is equal to 1024 or x is equal to 1024 divided by 16. Now 16 6 are 96 so 102 minus 96 is 6 6 carry over 64 divided by 16 is 4 so x is 64 now if we put the value of x in this so 9 multiplied by 64 so 9 fours are 36 so 6 is here and 3 carry over 6 nines are 54 plus 3 57 and the other part is 7 times x so 7 multiplied by 64 7 fours are 28 to carry over 6 7s are 42 plus 2 is 44 now if you add these two up so 576 plus 448 6 plus 8 14 7 plus 1 8 plus 4 12 and 5 plus 5 is 10 so the total comes out to 1024 so the 9 times x portion is 576 and 7 times x portion is 448. So basically this is also like 576 divided by 448 which is nothing but 9 multiplied by 64 divided by 7 multiplied by 64. 64, 64 gets cancelled so this is 9 by 7 is the ratio. Let's look at another way of solving this. So we have to split rupees 1024 in the ratio of 9 is to 7. So what this means is that if we split 1024 rupees into 16 parts, into 16 equal parts. Why 16? Because the total is 9 plus 7 is 16. So if we split rupees 1024 into 16 parts, then 9 parts out of those 16 parts is this portion of the ratio. And the 7 parts out of the 16 parts is this portion of the ratio. So first we have to split rupees 1024 into 16 equal parts. So what we do is we divide 1024 by 16. So 1 by 16 multiplied by 1024. 
so this will come out to be 64 and then we multiply this with 9 and with 7 so we'll get the same answers if you want to do a further shortcut what you can do is you can straight away take 9 so basically what we have done is we have taken 1 by 16 multiplied by 1024 multiplied by 9 right so this portion is equal to 64 which is this and then we multiplied it by 9 or we can also write it as 9 by 16 multiplied by 1024 and the second one will be 7 by 16 multiplied by 1024 so basically if you have to divide anything in a certain ratio you basically add the two numbers of the ratio for example we did 9 plus 7 put that in the denominator like we did 16 is in the denominator then put each number one by one in the numerator and multiply it by the number that you want to split up and you will get the answer.